So if we as UI designers are doomed versus AI, I know what you're thinking. With AI becoming better and better, should I really spend my time doing UI design or should I do something else? There is no denying AI is here to stay. We have Dolly 2 and Mid Journey outshining lifelong graphic designers. So as far I'm going to go winner left. We hear Joe Rogan talking to Steve Jobs in an AI generated podcast made some of the great technological products of our age. Good to see you, buddy. We have Hollywood level film posters made by random text prompts and hyper realistic phases of people that don't even exist. All of this on the back of AI technology. So if we as UI designers are doomed versus AI, before I give my honest take on that, let's dig a bit deeper into traditional design versus AI design. As designers, and for anyone competing against AI, we have three big problems. One, AI is super scalable. Since it's a computer, it grows with Moore's law and only needs computation power to scale. And while Moore's law is scaling a lot better than we humans do, we're not even getting into quant computing. That's really scary. Two, AI is super fast. Let's look back at the Dolly versus graphic designer example I showed in the intro. This is MKBHD's designer named Tim, great name. They decided to take on Dolly in a graphic design challenge in a recent video of theirs. And although Tim, who's super skilled by the way, won more than he lost against the AI. The left was Tim. Yay! Yeah! He spent three days. So we're on day number three of the challenge. Day number two was kind of rocky. While the AI spent seconds or minutes. And just give Dolly the 10 seconds it usually takes. Number three, AI learns and learns and learns. Just as us humans. The difference? Well, the AI never sleeps. It works day in, day out, even nighttime always processing and interpreting new information until the day where it actually beats us. And when it beats us, there is no coming back. We've lost the game. And I know this sounds super scary for us as designers. If this is what Dolly and all of these AIs can produce with random text prompts at this point, what about the future? Well, I personally think that it doesn't look too bad. Now let me explain why. Sure, focusing all of your efforts on pixel pushing will probably be a bad path since that's just the perfect application area for AI. I mean, think landing pages. They almost always look very much the same structurally. So an AI software could basically just scrape the biggest website aggregators and then reproduce thousands upon thousands of matching results or better results from just these scraping activities. And when you think about it, even today without AI, we already have a bunch of pre-made options like UI kits, templates. Many of these things have already been commoditized AI will just make it even more of a commodity in the future. So what then is it that separates us from AI? What's the one thing that will make us stay relevant in a world where machines do things that we used to do much better and much faster? Well, in my opinion, that thing is learning how to think as a designer, which means that we don't spend all our focus on visuals, although we should spend some time on visuals as well, but we start thinking about solving problems for humans. It means that we think about human needs, who the user is, what their day looks like, what their motivations are. We think about the use cases humans might have when interacting with our designs. Do they sit in a car when they use the app? Are they usually in a hurry or something else? Context matters. Currently, you can type in something like Dolly, create a transaction flow that accounts for scenario X, Y, and C, and that optimizes for trust and speed, 
for a user that just got onboarded to our fintech app. And I think those kinds of text prompts, prompts with complexity and layers upon layers and design trade-offs included, will take a while for AI to solve. So as long as we focus on our job, which is solving problems, real problems for real humans, we should be fine as UI designers, as designers overall. I have a question for y'all. When do you think AI will force us to become experts at text prompts instead of pixel pushers? Let me know in the comments below. Until the next one, have a great life. We'll talk soon. Ciao.